Okay, today we are back with a story. This story is called Inch by Inch. Um, it talks a little bit about measuring, and we have been learning about measuring, so you will recognize some of the words in this story. It is written and illustrated by Leo Leone, and it has a award on it. This is a Caldecott Honor Book. One day, a hungry robin saw an inchworm, green as an emerald, sitting on a twig. He was about to gobble him up. Don't eat me. I am an inchworm. I am useful. I measure things. Is that so, said the robin. Then measure my tail. That's easy, said the inchworm. One, two, three, four, five inches. Just think, said the robin, my tail is five inches long. And with the inchworm, he flew to where the other birds needed to be measured. The inchworm measured the neck of the flamingo. He measured the toucan's beak. The legs of the heron. The tail of the pheasant. The whole hummingbird. One morning, the nightingale met the inchworm. Measure my song, said the nightingale. But how can I do that, said the inchworm. I measure things, not songs. Measure my song, or I'll eat you for breakfast, said the nightingale. Then the inchworm had an idea. I'll try, he said. Go ahead and sing. Oh, and here's my cat. She always likes our stories. Bonnie, you have to move. The kids can't see the book. The nightingale sang, and the inchworm measured away. He measured and measured. Do you see him down here? He's measuring right out of the forest. Inch by inch. Until he inched out of sight. There he is, he's almost gone. And that is how the inchworm escaped. While the nightingale was singing, he just inched himself right away.